Hello there friends and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Frances and today I'm coming to you with a Disney Adorables opening. Um, I've never opened these on my channel but I'm very excited to show them with you because they're Haunted Mansion themed. And I did want to mention today's video is brought to you by iMethod and their eyeliner uh, stamp pen but we'll talk about this in a little bit. Anyway, Disney Adorables. Had a gift card on Amazon. Keep seeing this everywhere. We're just gonna, we're gonna attack it. I don't know how to open these. I also don't have scissors, so. Might not have been the smartest idea. I'm just gonna like rip it open, I guess. I don't know how this opens. Did I get it? How much of this box can I rip before taking them all out? little sheet so it's madame leota opera singer butler bride mummy groundskeeper three of the five like singing headstones the maid gus ezra phineas and apparently these are special editions i guess this thing goes with your doors and you can like hold them and whatnot i'm not gonna do this so we're just gonna like tear these guys open i don't know if i want to keep all of these guys yet but i thought they were adorable so we have this is Gus, right? Yeah. So we have Hitchhiking Gus. Let's get a little closer. Hitchhiking Gus. I'm gonna grab random ones. We have, oh, my favorite. Ezra's my favorite Hitchhiking Ghost. We have Ned Nub, which I don't know if I knew that the singing bus had names, which makes me a fake Haunted Mansion fan, but to each their own. I kind of want Madame Loretta and Constance if they're here. We have the groundskeeper. Try to get these guys to focus for you. There you go. So I've done four of the 12 so far. We have the opera singer, number five, okay, this is number six, this one feels very light and very small. We have the mansion maid, I have a Funko Pop that looks exactly like this. We have the mansion maid, there we go. And we are halfway through this, which means I'm going to talk about our sponsor for a second. So if you notice, every single video, I wear some sort of winged eyeliner on my eyes. I'm not gonna lie, they're stamps. I don't know how to draw eyeliner. I have tape that I can do it with like a felt pen, but like I'm so bad at it. But the stamp is literally so easy. You just line it up like the angle that you want, you stamp it, then you draw the rest of your eyeliner or you can draw and then stamp to each their own previously courted francis is going to come on in a second and show you but i method was super nice in reaching out and wanting to send me some products i will link them down below in the description so you can check them out pretty sure you can get this on amazon so not bad and this is their 10 millimeter stamp so you have and i'll show this again like um see if you can see it a little bit better i'll show this again like previously recorded Francis, but what is this? This is the right side or the left side? So this is right, so you would line it up, stamp, and then draw with the rest of it. Again, this is literally a lifesaver. I love wearing winged liner. It takes literally 30 seconds. Stamp, stamp, draw, draw. But anyway, we're gonna cut to previously recorded Francis to show you how I actually do this and use this in real life. Previously recorded Francis here. We clearly are not wearing the same makeup, but I'm going to the Disney park So we went a little bit crazy with it, but I have done everything except my eyeliner and my setting spray So I figured I would show you How to use the eye method stamp and we're gonna attempt to this one-handed So you do this and you're gonna go We're going to show you as I do this in the mirror so there is the stamp part for the right side. Sorry, this is 
one-handed is not easy. Okay, we're gonna flip your hands here. This is where this might go bad because this is left and I'm not left-handed and I'm holding you in. We're gonna put you back in my left hand. And you just line it up where you want it and stamp. You can see both of them and then I will come back when the liner is drawn on. So I just took the really, really tiny felt tip liner and connected it. So you can see that I have eyeliner and a wing and it's easy like that. I don't know how to draw wings on so we just stamped them on. So thank you for thank you to iMethod for sponsoring this video and sending me some goodies to try. Hope you all enjoyed and back to your normally scheduled programming. <laughs> and we're back. Okay, six more to go. So, so far we have the maid, the opera singer, groundskeeper, two of the hitchhiking ghosts, and one of the busts. I just want Madame Leota and the bride. Is that too much to ask? I don't know, like, these are random. Another bust. Uh, this bust looks very similar to the other bust. This is Rolo Rumpkin, whoever the heck that is, again. Fake Haunted Mansion fan. We have a butler, which I also have this guy in my, um, like in Funko Pop form. Okay, we have the last of the ghosties, so we have Phineas. Hatbox ghost would have been amazing, but I guess this is Disney World's mansion. Three more to go. The last of the busts, so this is Cousin Algernon. I don't know if I pronounced that correctly. Two more, and I want the bride. And Adam Leota, and I don't know if I'm getting them. This is Constance, so we got one of them. Constance Hatchaway. My girl, she's somewhere over there. This could be a Madame Leota. I don't really know what I got myself into with these things. No, this is a mummy. This is a mummy. It says bonus figures, Madame Leota. Did I just not get one? Well, that makes me sad. I wanted Madame Leota. Okay, so we got everyone on this list, if it focuses. Minus Madame Leota, which is why I'm covering her up. I picked these up on Amazon. They were like, I don't know, $14, $15 for like 12 little figures. I love Honda Mansion, so this won't go to waste. Um, I know they do other Disney Dorables. Let me down below if you've seen the Haunted Mansion ones, if you've opened them, if you've opened other Disney Dorables. I don't think I'm going to do this again. I only did this because it was Haunted Mansion themed. But yeah. Um, uh, if you liked this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up. It is a great way to support my channel. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. I do a lot of random Disney content. And if you're already subscribed, please hit that bell icon so you're notified when I post new videos. I hope you all are staying happy, healthy, and safe. I hope you enjoyed this random Haunted Mansion Dorables. Adorables? Dorables. Dorables unboxing. Um, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye. And you never know what kind of figment you may come up with. Oh, here's my favorite.